Okay, let's have a little look at the soils that we find in the rainforest. So we've got the different lateral levels. Okay, most of the rainforest there is just this sort of big, thick layer of old mud decomposed of the trees and things. Now, the nutrients aren't in this layer where my finger's going out at all. The nutrients are just in the layer at the top here. Okay, that's where all the dead decomposing sort of leaves are. Okay, down here it's already sort of been absorbed. But we can see here we're by a, a river, a sort of a little small stream, and where the streams come through, it's washed away a lot of the material, and that's why we can see this sort of thick layer of mud, which goes a lot deeper. Um, what you also can kind of see here is that where the roots aren't there, the, the sort of river sort of washed away a lot of material, and there's lots of sort of things that are in the stream here from deforestation from lockdown some of them are sort of naturally falling trees some of them are from cut down so when you have a big sort of rain that will wash down a lot of these materials and you can sort of see some of the dead materials there down the stream and break off in sort of little pieces and when we have deforestation like this when sort of on a larger scale where big trees are cut down the rain comes along and it washes away all of the sort of the tree bits and it rips away the ground too and there's huge amounts of deforestation you might see pictures of sort of large areas of red earth sometimes maybe in an exam or something a big area sort of red brownie earth and you think what is that that's where the trees have been sort of taken away and then the rivers and the rainwater has washed away all the roots so you're just left with this darkish ready soil